Thanks for joining us on News 9. I'm Sylvia Corkill. Our top story tonight, the OSBI is investigating the disappearance of a Chickasha man who's been missing since August. The man's sister speaking with our Cameron Joyner tonight, saying her brother was just starting to turn his life around. Family of Richard Houston say he went missing from this Life Skills Institute in Chickasha over a month ago. They say this was a place that was helping Richard get on the right track. Gone outside to smoke a cigarette and just never came back in. The pain of the uncertainty. That's pretty much all we know. Hangs heavy on Kimberly Adair. It's just not like him. Her 46 year old brother, Richard Houston, was last seen on August 31st. The OSBI now taking over the investigation. And it's just heartbreaking to me because I don't know if he's okay. That's all I want to know is he's okay and if he's safe. Kimberly says her brother experienced addiction problems and homelessness. He came back in and then decided to do the hard work. Leading him to the Life Skills Institute and Resurrection House, a safe haven for people in his position. And I think that's one of the issues, the stigma. Oh, well, they've had some issues. They've been homeless. Don't want to be found. That's not always the case. Kimberly doesn't believe her brother would leave without a word. He didn't go this long without contacting me. And according to his sister, Richard was on an upward trend. For one, he'd been clean since June. Holding a job and utilizing services at the Life Skills Institute, well on his way to getting an apartment. He was doing great. It was doing great. As OSBI continues their investigation, Kimberly is holding out hope. I don't, want, I don't want to give up. That answers will replace the uncertainty. In Chickasha, Cameron Joyner, Oklahoma Zone, News 9. And the OSBI tells News 9 they can't comment on the active investigation, but if you know anything about Richard Houston's whereabouts, contact OSBI at the number on your screen.